it's Latified again and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a custom transparent spray in Counter-Strike Source, Counter-Strike, Day of Defeat Source, Team Fortress 2, whatever, any of those Steam Source games. So the first thing you want to do is open up Photoshop and you want to go to File New. You want to create a 256 by 256 document and under Background Contents you want to do Transparent and press OK. I've already prepared the spray that I want to use. It's right here. So after you're done making what you're going to do is you're going to click File, Save for Urban Devices. Then you want to go to Preset, you just want to go to Unnamed. You're going to go to PNG24 and you're going to check Transparent. Then you're just going to save that anywhere you want. Once you're done doing that, you're going to open up the program called SprayR. It's going to be on the right um, where, the YouTube, where my video description is. And for Steam account, you're going to go find your Steam account. For game, you're going to find whatever game you want to import it as. You're going to press Add. Then you're going to find the image wherever it's at. And you're going to press Create. What this is going to do is it's going to automatically put the transparent spray into your Steam folder. Into your uh, Images folder, sorry, for your sprays. So as soon as you open up Counter-Strike Source or whatever game you're playing, you can go to options and then sprays and all you do is look at your sprays and it's going to be the bottom one alright guys so once you have the spray saved and imported th using uh, spray art you're going to just open up counter strike source or whatever game you're playing you're going to go to options and under spray paint image you're going to have your sprays here you're going to go all the way down and it's going to be the last spray then you're just going to press apply and ok Alright guys, well now it's time to get in game and show off your new spray. So all you're going to do is go against the wall or the floor and press T2 spray. And there you go. Now you have a transparent spray. And remember, this spray doesn't look very high quality because I'm running low options to record this. It will look much nicer when you're doing it yourself. So guys, thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please post below. And remember to subscribe. Thanks again. Bye.